Hornets select Chris Paul from Wake Forest University. Yo, what's up, guys? Today I'm going to be talking about how Chris Paul's intelligence is so underrated throughout the NBA and throughout his long NBA career. Chris Paul is arguably one of the best point guards of all time and one of the best, one of the smartest NBA players of all time throughout his intelligent play on the court and off the court. Chris Paul was an all-academic award winner in 2015. He also received a bachelor's degree in 2022 from Winston-Salem State University for Communications. So it isn't just... Remember to subscribe, it helps a lot. Back that, and I figured it'd be a cool thing to talk about before I head back to college in late August. So speaking of Chris Paul, he's always had high assist numbers. He knows exactly what to do in pick and roll situations. He knows when to score. He knows when to get to the open teammate. Throughout his experiences, and his hardship. It hasn't always been easy for Chris Paul getting drafted to the New Orleans City Hornets. Chris Paul is so much smarter than the average NBA player. Throughout the 2007-2008 NBA season, that is arguably Chris Paul's best NBA season throughout his career, where he came second in MVP voting. He averaged 21.1 points per game, 11.6 assists per game, and 2.7 steals. The reason Chris Paul has been able to stay so long in the NBA is not just his playmaking ability and his knowledge, it's also his defense. When you're a short NBA guard like Chris Paul, you have to be able to play defense. That should be the main focus to try to stay in the league. And truthfully, with Trey Young, he's an elite offensive player, but he needs to get a little better at defense. He's young enough to be able to experience that though. Give him some time, hopefully he'll get a little better. Once Chris Paul got off the New Orleans tournament, he then went over to the Los Angeles Clippers and that's when the Lob City threat appeared with Chris Paul being with Blake Griffin and DeAndre Jordan. And that trio as we remember it would have never been as good if Chris Paul wasn't so intelligent. He was able to put passes in such spots that other players couldn't even fathom trying to do because Chris Paul is that damn smart. I'm saying that word a lot, but it's really what Chris Paul brings to the table is his IQ, his versatility, his quickness, and his playmaking ability throughout the offensive and defensive end. And you might ask yourself, how does Chris Paul bring versatility to the defensive end? He, well, he gets a lot of steals, he's pretty quick on his feet, and he's able to defend shots and get there quick, quicker than the average NBA smaller type of point guard. That's what Chris Paul does. He is so, so, so knowledgeable throughout his experience. He played for the Oklahoma City Thunder as well as the Houston Rockets recently got traded from the Golden State Warriors to the San Antonio Spurs. Now he's with Victor Wembanyama, and he's going to help improve Victor Wembanyama's game to a whole nother level. Chris Paul brings so much experience to the table. The sad thing is that he may not win a ring, but you can sure not count out his experience and his expertise the matter of clutch game situations, what he brings to a team on his impact level for what he's able to do on any given level whether it's going to get or oh, i'm not going to say trash team i'm going to say a low tier team or high ranking team it doesn't matter chris pole is always going to keep that same energy he's been mainly consistent throughout his nba career he's dealt with some bad injuries but he gets back up from them he's able to rehab once he comes back you know what Chris Paul is going to provide. Able to be so smart off the pick and roll. He's able to detect defensive schemes that your rookie point guards would most likely not be able to detect. And that's because of Chris Paul's hard work, dedication to always getting better, and to always wanting to succeed. I love Chris Paul. I have so much respect for him. And he's going to go down in history as a legend, for sure. I want to talk about how underrated Chris Paul's knowledge of the game is because that's something that's not often talked about actually not it is often talked about with Chris Paul but Chris Paul is not the often player to be talked about 
Thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoy. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.